expecting the audience to understand exactly why someone in our world, or at least a heightened version of our world, would dress up like a bat in order to save his city and in order to feel whole. That's where this idea of being grounded, of being realistic, comes into play. These movies are often called the realistic take on Batman, but most people don't really get what that means. It's not necessarily about a direct reality, because I think the films are extremely heightened and they're extremely operatic, but it's about what I suppose you might term as cinematic reality. It's about giving the world of the films and the characters as much weight and validity as they would if your source material were not a comic book. So how do you make a superhero film cinematically real? I have no idea. My short films range from pretentious and bad to just bad, but if I had to take a guess, I would say that following the path set by Richard Donner's classic Superman film would go a long way in helping you achieve that believability. One of the things that... Good. Waste of time. Waste of time. Okay, that's good. Kind of. Oh my god, my movement is so bad. Almost overlooked that. I'm not getting PB. Definitely not getting world record. No, that's impossible. On this pace. that luck that is awful I haven't worth it just juke her in the principal's office Okay.